Hey YouTube, Matches860, smoking a Savinelli second with some Sir Walter Raleigh, talking about uh, how I come to smoke certain pipes at certain times. When I first started thinking about it, I figured I choose um, certain pipes just so that I don't have to make a decision, especially on days that I have to work. If I have a Monday pipe, Tuesday pipe, it's much easier just to grab it and go out the door. But then I realized. I only have a dedicated pipe for two days of the week for work. My days off, I only have a dedicated pipe for Fridays, which you know is my Friday Savinelli second. Got me to thinking, you know, there's got to be some rhyme or reason to why I do certain things. So, started thinking about my Sunday pipe first. And, uh, when I go to work, um, I always like to put my best foot forward, if you will. And my uh, Butcha Khan pipes are probably my nicest looking. I have a Design Berlin, um, a couple of higher end Savinelli's. But for whatever reason, I chose uh, this for my Sunday pipe. And uh, there's something about getting up in the morning and uh, being excited about going to work and reaching for this. Really a decent looking pipe. And my job has changed over the years. You know, I used to take a one of my estates to work, or a Dr. Grabo, or other inexpensive pipe. But back in those days, I was uh, more of a working manager. And the, uh, the less expensive pipes sort of depicted the type of work I was doing. Whereas now, um, probably more like 80% management and 20% hands-on. So, you know, taking a, a better looking pipe sort of boosts my morale quite a bit. I do have some uh, used estate pipes at work and a corn cob that I keep there um, basically um, if one of my pipes should all of a sudden get wet, unsmokable. That was the main reason I had them there. But I find sometimes, depending on the day, I might want to take a corn cob out on my break. Especially if things are going really well and I want to really kick back. But there is something, something for me about going out of the house to work with uh, a really nice looking pipe. My day's off, of course. 
I have my uh, choice of all the rest of my pipes, really. And as you can see again today, I'm a Savinelli second. And these really define who I am in that uh, I have flaws like everybody else and certainly like the pipe does. And, uh, you know, the older you get, the more you come to terms with those flaws and the more comfortable you get with yourself. So, these flawed pipes are like my best friends on my day off. When I can really get in touch with myself, be comfortable with who I am. It's kind of a connection there. My other uh, weekend or evening pipes, uh, quite often, I'll pick a uh, old K Woody like this one. This is uh, probably from the late 30s, early or mid 40s. And they're sort of a in-between midway pipe. It's not ugly, but it's not high-end either. For me, it really defines uh, pipe smoking history, especially in the United States. And a pipe like this is a lot of fun to smoke when, uh, when I'm at home. If I've had an especially good day and I want to pamper myself at night, I might go for a uh, Savinelli Bing's Favorite. About as close as I'll ever get probably to a church warden. But especially right before bed, if I smoke a bowl out of this, uh, good times, good times. And then some of my other pipes uh, have their own particular place. This barling. fairly decent looking pipe. Almost always goes out with me if I get dressed up. And, uh, you know, I could probably take any one of my pipes out with me. But again, when I get dressed up, I want to have my accessories look just as good as the rest of me. And, uh, that always fills the bill. I guess uh, that's probably about it. I can't imagine uh, smoking a one of my boot chicans on my days off. Um, it's sort of like getting dressed up with nowhere to go. Neither would I uh, take this pipe to work with me. Because for me it would be like uh, putting on sneakers with a three-piece suit. Uh, just out of place. Um, and that's probably more of a mental thing than anybody, anything else. But uh, that's how it is. And that's how I uh, sort of pick my pipes out. Hope you found it interesting and made you think about your own pipes and when you smoke them and when you don't. Thanks an awful lot for watching.